Hey guys, it's Tina. I am back today with a Babies R Us haul. That's right, I have a humongous bag of awesomeness here sitting next to me. Uh, we went to Babies R Us yesterday uh, just to pick up a few things. We had some store credits and some gift cards, so we had a really, really good time in the store. I got a lot of stuff for Emmy. I also got some stuff um, related to pumping and breastfeeding and all that cool stuff, so I'm gonna show you guys what I got. Okay, the very, very first thing here is this kick and play piano gym for Emmy. This is so she can do tummy time and it's got all kinds of like activities on there. It's got like a little mirror and little toys she can play with and, and look at and things. And then at the end here is a piano so that when she kicks her feet, she can like kick the piano pieces and they make music and lights and all kinds of stuff. See, oh wait. Yeah, like that. So we're really excited to set that up and let her start playing with that. <laughs> Okay, next I picked up two of these diaper pail refill bags. Now we had gotten this diaper pail as a gift. Um, it was on our registry. Somebody bought it for us for the baby before the baby came. It has been a lifesaver for us. We keep it down next to her. Um, we have like a, a changing station on our pack and play, which is in our bedroom right now. And it's just amazing. It holds a ton of diapers. The refills are pretty expensive, I will say. Um, these were on sale too for $35. But this is 32 bags, 800 diapers a piece, 1,600 diapers. That's gonna get us, you know, not not through our entire, uh, you know, youth in diapers, but it's gonna it's gonna get us pretty far. So we won't have to buy this again, probably, hopefully, for a long time. All right, next I picked up this Ultimate Swim Diaper, and this is in the size small. This is a reusable diaper that you can wash and keep using again. Um, it's uh, I I was. In, I was gonna get her like a pack of just swimming diapers, but they don't make them small enough for her. Uh, probably because, you know, a lot of babies her age don't swim, um, which we're not going swimming per se, but I did buy a little kiddie pool that's pretty much for me, but I wanted to be able to take her in as well. And plus we've got, you know, we're, we're here in Florida, mm -hmm. there's always around water and stuff like that. So I figured this will, this will go up to 18 pounds. Um, so this should last us for quite a while. So in case we end up doing something where it's water related, we, you know, have a swim diaper on hand for her. Okay. Next, I got these multi-purpose ground cloths, and again, this is for like taking to the beach, stuff like that. That's why we got them. They were on sale, buy one, get one free. I think they came out to be $1.25 a piece or something ridiculously cheap like that. So it just looks like this kind of like blue, um, it's material, it's not plastic. It's um, it's kind of like, I'm trying to think of the, it's like netting, you know, like you would find it like inside like gym shorts or something like that. Um, so yeah, we got two of those just because they were buy one, get one free, but we're excited to use those at the beach. Okay, these were also on sale. Almost all of their summer clothes for babies are on sale, but these were $2, so I had to get her another pair of sunglasses. She has pink ones, but she definitely needed purple in her collection. Okay, I picked up some of the clothes I was talking about that were on sale. Now, um, this is a Carter's, this is a 12 month, so this won't fit her for a long time to come. But this was on sale for $4.98 on clearance, and then also all of their clearance clothes were an additional 30% off. So this was very, very inexpensive, and it's just got this little like cardigan type thing here. It has a onesie underneath and then it's also got a pair of pants that come with it. Next I got her this little adorable 4th of July outfit. Again, um, $3.98, an additional 30% off of that. So very, very cheap, right around $3. But, um, and again, I got this in a size that will hopefully fit her next 4th of July. We'll see, keep your fingers crossed. Okay, another super cute outfit. This one wasn't quite as cheap, but it was so cute I had to get it. This was $10 um, clearance, also another 30% off, so $7. Um, but it comes with this little top here and it's got a little um, diaper cover down there and then a onesie in the back with an adorable little toucan on it. Okay, this actually was my husband's find. He wanted me to get this. He said he heard that these are like the most amazing thing ever. So this is a mommy hook, and this just goes on her stroller like that. So you can hang like shopping bags, your purse, you know, all kinds of stuff from the hook, from the handle of the stroller. All right, next I got some water wipes. So I've, I've seen these in a million people's, um, I've seen them all over the place. I've seen them on Pinterest. I've seen people talk about them. I have not tried them yet, and we are still on the hunt for our perfect baby wipe. We were kind of trying like all the different brands, um, going through a bunch of different ones just to see which one we prefer over all of them. And um, I picked these up just to give them a try. They were on sale, I think they were two for six if I'm not mistaken, so kind of expensive um, for baby wipes, but we figured we'd try them and they're supposed to be pretty good. They're 99 
0.9% water and then 0.1% fruit extract. So apparently they're pretty good, especially for newborns with their sensitive skin and stuff like that. Okay, next I picked up this baby banana teething toothbrush for Emmy. So she's not teething just yet and she's not really even using this type of toy yet, but she will be very soon um, in the next couple of months or so. So I got her this, it's kind of like a training toothbrush. It's got the ends, it's like rubber bristles on there to get him used to the feeling of a toothbrush in their mouth. And on top of that, it's also a teether that she can chew on when she does start teething. So pick that up for her. Another teether we got here, just the normal simple, you know, ones you put in the freezer and they freeze and then they can chew on them and they're nice and cold. Okay, I got two packs of these Tommy Tippy um, pacifiers. These are by far her favorite pacifiers. We picked up a pack of these before she was born and we had gone through like probably two or three different brands and she likes her Wub and Nub too, but this is by far the favorite. So we went ahead, they were buy one get one half off I think. So we went ahead and picked up two packs of those. Okay, I kind of went crazy on the uh, Medela stuff and I'll show you guys all of that. The last little thing I picked up here is this Dapol lavender dish liquid. This is what I use um, at home to wash her bottles. So I got this to keep in her diaper bag or maybe in my pump bag to wash the bottles and pump parts when I'm pumping on the go. Okay, now all the Medela stuff. So I got this box of breast milk bottles, spare parts. This is just the rings for the bottles and then the lids and all that stuff. Again, I only had one that came with I think it was another kit that I had bought. I don't think it came with the pump, but I only had one nipple, Medela nipple, and one um, little travel lid for her. So this will just make it a little bit easier. Now we'll have a few extras on hand in case that one gets lost or if it's being used or what have you. Okay, next I picked up the Medela wide base nipples. This is in a medium flow. She's got one nipple um, from Medela right now, as I mentioned, but it's slow flow, and I think she's we should probably move into medium maybe shortly I don't know that Medela nipple I think it's meant to simulate breastfeeding so it's really really slow compared to the other nipples that we use for her bottles so I wanted to get the medium just to try and see if it's a little bit better for her because she gets kind of frustrated sometimes and gets angry when the milk milk's not coming out as fast as she wants it to so we thought we'd give these a try okay next I picked up this Medela quick clean breast milk removal soap this is supposedly the best soap you can buy for washing bottles da 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 um, I picked it up to actually do my my parts my breast pump parts uh, with so we'll see hopefully it'll work pretty good okay next I picked up some spare membranes for my breast pump if you use a breast pump before you know that these are extremely important if you lose those or if they get ripped or broken the pump doesn't work anymore so I picked some up to keep on hand and then I also got these quick clean wipes these are again to throw into the pump bag that I uh, travel with so that I can clean up the pump parts and things like that on the go um, without having to be near a sink if I don't have access to one right away okay last thing I picked up is these advent um, they are washable, reusable pads for your bra, like, like breast pads, so that if you're leaking at all, which I have a lot of problems with, <laughs> um, that, that these help you know protect against that. So hopefully these work pretty good. I've been using like some disposable ones that I had picked up throughout the months, you know, as I was pregnant and stuff like that, and I have not found one yet that isn't super bulky and shows through my shirt. So I'm really hoping those are nice you know, hopefully pretty thin and won't be as, you know, as obvious when I'm wearing um, a shirt and going out in public. <laughs> All right, guys, well, that's the end of my video today. Thank you so, so, so much for watching. If you are new to my channel and you are not subscribed, please do subscribe and I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Hi, girl. Are you awake? Did you want to say hi? Yeah. Hi, beautiful. Oh. so precious. Okay, say bye, girl. Say bye. Bye. <laughs>